Hello, my name is Natalia Tomino, and this is my final review project for fall semester. These are the five words that describe my final review project best. Variation, impression, inspiration, unity, and harmony. Initially, we needed to create 18 drawings of the hand in three different media. Each hand had to be in a different pose. I used pencil, pen, and colored pencil. Some of these drawings are contour drawings, and some are blind contours. It was not easy to pick from the great variation of sketches. In the end, I chose the drawing with the relaxed hand. The way the hand turned out also gave me the impression of it looking slightly unmoving, even dead. After choosing one hand, it had to be converted into a three-dimensional version of it using wire with a standout of copper wire. My hand was relatively minimalist and I decided not to cover it fully with wire because it seemed to represent the drawing well enough. Also, I felt that too much wire on the hand would detract from its relaxed expression. We also drew the wire hand in thumbnails and full-size drawings using value and including the shadows cast by the wire hand. Later, we added regulating lines to the drawings. They will later become the bases for the openings in the cladding. My lines initially crossed the entire composition and then they were narrowed down to emphasize one part of it. The initial concepts were revised to make the box and its joints more functional and easy to build. After testing the shadows on a cladding placeholder, I saw that the fingers of the shadow extended beyond the top edge and along the side. The way they were cast reminded me of the hand's position when playing the piano, especially when going up. This gave me the idea to make cladding inspired by piano keys under the hand. The openings would emphasize the fingers using shadow on the opposite side of the cladding. The physical box, for now, was still a structural support for the wire hand and future cladding made to hold them in place securely. The box is unified via double vertical and horizontal elements and a heavy base and corners. This diagram illustrates the order of assembling the box's parts. The sketch of the cladding illustrated in perspective view. The parallel openings were moved from the bottom to the top. The piano inspired cladding balances the functionality of the box and creates harmony between the constructive elements, the semi-translucent screen, and the wire hands long shadows. The sections illustrate the cladding in flattened top, side, and front views. The room for the light box has a ramp in order to provide a gradual rise up to the viewing platform, which has an extension that allows the box to be viewed from the distance. The last version of the physical model visually demonstrates the influence of light on the combination of the hand and cladding mounted on the box. At the end of my presentation, I would like to list the words that seem to me most fitting for my project. Variation, impression, inspiration, unity, and harmony.